All right, so with all this uh, new dirt that's been coming out uh, about the Clinton campaign and pretty much how the mainstream media is nothing more than a PR firm for Clinton, I thought I'd take a look at some other indicators of interest to compare what kind of interest people have in Donald Trump compared to Clinton. And I found two things, one about Google search trends, um, and the other is, I know, kind of weird, but uh, Chia Pet sales. So first, we've got Google Trends, and if you do a trends analysis for how to vote for Trump compared to how to vote for Clinton, we can see that Trump is 100 compared to 30, which means that Trump has more than three times the search volume or interest than Clinton. And when we look at Chia Pet sales, it says here that the Chia polls shows that Trump now leads Clinton by 79 to 21%. And that is a multiplier of 3.8. And when I double checked it with Amazon to see what kind of reviews were left, I see that Donald Trump's got 30 reviews and Clinton's got nine. So we compare that and that's pretty close again at 3.3 times the amount of interest. And I thought I'd compare it to a recent poll that I just came across, um, the Arizona Freedom Alliance poll, which polled over 50,000 people, 1,000 people in 50 states, and they came up with 67 to 19 for Trump. And if you look at that, that's again, three and a half times the interest. So with these considerations here, looking at these things here, Trump has three and a half times more interest than Clinton. And so, I mean, how accurate is these Google Trends and the Chia Pet poll? Well, looking back at 2012, we can see that for Google Trends, Obama versus Romney, how to vote for Obama versus how to vote for Romney, clocked in at 100 to 66, which means that Obama had one and a half times the amount of search volume for the term how to vote for Obama compared to Romney. And when we look at the Chia Pet poll for 2012, it said, where is it, um, the sales were 62.9 for Obama to 36.3. So what is the multiplier there? Pretty much what the Google Trends multiplier was, 1.73 to 1.52 compared to 3.8 to 3.3. I think this is like 12% more and this is like 14% more, but pretty similar. And in the 2012 election, we saw that Obama came out four points ahead and he had one over one and a half times the interest with Google search trends and the Chia Pet poll. So is it safe to say that with one and a half times the interest, Obama was able to secure a 4% lead and that with three and a half times the interest, Trump will be able to have an 8% lead in the final election? Well, I guess we'll find out.